this is just a little video to show the uh, orbit ball at work. Um, it's a great training aid for various aspects of your uh, skills development. Um, I'm just going to use it now to uh, demonstrate how you can practice your uh, sideline cuts. All right, it's a great skill in the game, and uh, the more you practice like any other skill, uh, the better you'll get at it. Okay, now just uh, when you're striking a sideline ball, you want to strike the part of the ball that's smooth. Okay, the round, smooth part of the ball here, 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 wherever. wherever you, that's, that's the way you want to set it up. Okay, if you want your hurl to come in at an angle, low angle, and you want, you want it to strike that smooth section of the ball. So it should go in the direction that the strike uh, is aimed at. If it strikes a ridge, like so, okay, it may impart a, sl a spin to the right or a spin to the left away from the target you're, you're aiming at, okay? So that's why I like to have just the smooth part of the ball as uh, the striking area of from the hurl onto the slitter, okay? So I'm just going to set it up here now. I'm going to aim uh, at the garage door that you can see over there. That's my target, okay? I'm going to have my ball aligned so that this smooth area is, what we say, square to the target. So my hurl will come in at a low angle and strike it in that direction, the general direction I want to, or I hope so anyway, okay? So I'll just have a nice piece of grass here. Place the ball down, place it that way, or you can place it this way. But again, you have to make sure that your hurl, as it comes in at a low angle, will strike this smooth part of the ball there, okay? So here's my ball placed, okay, with that target in mind. There it is, set up on my piece of grass there. So I'm going to come in low, and as you like every sideline, you have to get down low, the hurl will come in at a very low angle, almost across the grass before it makes a strike. Okay, so hopefully this, this will go well. And you can see the ball has come back straight to me from the strike. Now I'll try one more here again. My target is the garage door again. Same spot, or just beside it, another nice piece of grass there. Okay, there's my smooth section of the ball where I'd be, it'd be making contact or the hurl would be making contact. And we'll try it once more. And again, the ball has come straight back into my hand. Okay, so that's just one way the orbit ball can be used to practice your skills. Uh, if you're in a confined space like in a, a, an urban garden or a small size, small size garden, it's perfect for that. I'm lucky, I live in the countryside, I have a nice uh, big area to practice on, but I can still use the orbit ball. It's much handier than tearing off over there after a hurling ball to go get it. Go get it. Uh, also, it saves the gable end as well, a nice freshly painted gable end. Okay, so thanks very much.